In this video, you will learn about anorexia nervosa and how it affects the digestive system. Brenda, you don't look so well. Are you okay? I feel really dizzy today. I think I might faint. Maybe we should take you to the doctor. I think I'll be fine. Okay, but stay home from school today. Oh no! We have to get you to a doctor's immediately! What seems to be the problem? My daughter just fainted. She hasn't been eating and she's been feeling dizzy all day. Well, she does look quite thin, and you say she hasn't been eating. Sounds like symptoms of anorexia nervosa, but let me take a closer look. Now I'm going to run some blood tests and take your heart rate. I'm sorry to say, but your daughter has anorexia. It's good that we caught it sooner than later. What's anorexia nervosa? Anorexia is a disorder where people are afraid of gaining weight and wish to be slim. Many people are obsessive with their eating habits and usually see themselves as overweight. There are two types of anorexia, the purging type and the restricting type. The purging type will eat large amounts of food in a short amount of time and then will self-induce vomiting or misuse laxatives which is similar but not the same as bulimia. The restricting type is where the person will not eat food without any personal recommendation. There are many biological, psychological, and environmental symptoms. Some common symptoms include thin appearance, growth of baby hair on the body in an attempt to keep you warm due to the lack of fat, absence of menstruation, low blood pressure, abnormal blood count, dizziness or fainting, constipation, and abdominal pain. Some of the risks can be life-threatening. Some of the major risks include heart problems, including a slower heart rate because your body is trying to save energy. It also compromises your immune system as your body isn't getting the nutrients it needs. This will make you sick more often. You may also experience intestinal problems as well as iron deficiency or in extreme cases, kidney failure. There are also many negative effects on the digestive system, such as gastrointestinal problems, which is the paralysis of the gastrointestinal system, called gastroparesis. This may temporarily require a liquid diet, a suction tube, or medication. For the binge eating type, Mallory Weiss Tears Syndrome is very common. This syndrome is where the esophagus tears, which results from increased esophageal pressure, which is caused by self-induced vomiting. For the binge eating type, some patients' esophagus may rupture. This is called acute gastric dilation, which is caused by the delayed gastric emptying when the stomach becomes stretched with food and the stomach loses the ability to empty its contents, which results in the obstruction of blood flow to the intestine, which leads to gastric rupture. Some patients may be diagnosed with sialadenosis. This is where the parotid glands are swollen, which is caused by repeated purging. Oh my, what can we do? Is there a treatment? Treatment is mostly psychological through psychotherapy as the goal is to restore the person to a healthy weight and reduce behaviors that lead to irregular eating. Doctors come in to help when your health is severely threatened. Family-based therapy is also shown to be beneficial for young people like you as they might not be willing to regain the weight. Family-based therapy also helps with younger patients who are not willing to come to therapy. Some psychological treatments include behavioral therapy, cognitive therapy, interpersonal psychotherapy, and specialist supportive clinical management. Before you leave, I will refer you to a specialist and they will address any health problems that could have occurred as a side effect of anorexia nervosa. Sadly, there is no way to prevent this. However, keeping up with a healthy behavior and treatment helps. Thank you so much! We'll start therapy immediately! But I don't want to go to therapy! It sounds so scary! Honey, don't worry. Therapy will make you feel better. And if you want, we can do family-based therapy. Okay, I guess that sounds better. Don't worry. Everything is going to be okay. Thank you for listening. Now you know what anorexia nervosa is, the possible types, the symptoms, the risks, and the negative effects it has on the digestive system, as well as treatment.